Hello everyone, welcome to another session. I just wanted to give you some information about some of the things that I was working on. Uh, but before I take you there, uh, let me just uh, give you the information that we are learning Django with me as TipK Learner. So here uh, I wanted to show you uh, uh, various other things there. So what I did initially in, in, in all my example in this series, I have been using my demo in capital, but I've been seeing one error, which I saw in the view. So here uh, it was saying that the views are usually of all small characters. So that's the reason I changed it to my demo one. But then I wanted to talk about what are the other changes that will happen if I change this to my, uh, my demo to demo one to small. So what has happened is once I've changed this, I had to go to this URL page and here I had to write down the, the actual name of the view that we were talking about. So that, that name is now all small my demo one and the name of the view that is the class. And then uh, this is the path. So we are talking about the location where it is and the location is this folder. So that is where my demo one is coming in then i had to also see if there was some changes in the parent url so in the parent url no changes were made this is my demo one urls and that's the exactly same thing which we have kept there so this was about the urls or routings that we were using now the other thing that i wanted to talk about is about the um, about the data that we were working on so i'll take you back to the to the view that we had in the my demo one so if you see in the view um i have to import my demo one so i created an alias with the name of my d1 i wanted it initially because my demo i had the same case as this one so it was a conflicting there but if i remove this now all that i have to change is this part and once I change it, everything works. So here we are getting all the values. We are loading the template. That is the page. We are creating a context and then we are passing the context with the request. So uh, if, if I run it now in this way as well, I'll first go to file and save all. And then uh, it is saying that it will be reloading the page. If everything goes good, we if I refresh this page with control F5, I should get the same value without any error. But if you want, what I can do is I can copy this URL, close it, open it up again, and then paste it here. So it will be creating demo one and it will be giving me the value. So that's all that I wanted to talk about. I was just trying to give you a difference between the views and the model. You can see in the model we have the model with my demo one which is capital um so that's how it is completely mapping everything so once again i thank you thank you for um uh, learning with me i hope we have moved a bit forward in our learning to contact me you can write me in youtube comments or you can email me to tipklearner at gmail.com bye bye good day